Hello there and welcome to the new Pandas tutorial and in this Pandas tutorial I will show you how you can install the Pandas which is helpful in doing the data analysis. So that is the very first step as to how you can download and install it. Well here I am on the command prompt and it should be the location where your python is installed and using the pip command pip install pandas the this is the command which i need to use or you need to use wherever it is there in your system on the windows to install pandas so once i enter it you will see that right now it is showing you the requirement already satisfied because it has identified the python is already installed or oh, sorry the pandas is already installed in my system so before the version 2.7 or up until 2.7 uh, Python was not giving the pandas as the default package but after that it has started giving me so if I just see my Python version over here you will see that I'm using 3.7.6 so in this case I already have the Python but in case if you are facing any issue that Python is not installed for some reason the command is pip install pandas now let's go into the Jupyter notebook and see how we can install there so here I am into the Jupyter Notebook and here is a slight change in the command and the command is start with the exclamation sign and then pip install pandas. Alright, so once I install this, it will also going to tell me that pandas is already installed because if you are having the Anaconda or this Jupyter Notebook, then there is a very high chance or almost like 100% uh, that you have the pandas already installed. So once you have installed it, how you can import to use it? Well, you use the import pandas. Most of the time in many various program, you must have seen that uh, an alias like PD is given and that is very useful in scenarios when you need to refer it. So we can give the alias like this import pandas as PD. So whenever we need to reference the pandas package in the future in, in, in the uh, next level of coding that we will do, we will just reference the PD instead of the entire name and that will basically help us reduce our code so once i execute you will see that pd is uh, now present or it's been imported and now i can do the command like pd dot and if i enter like read so here once i press the tab you will see the various different command and what i am basically writing over here is the read underscore csv just to show you the various different commands and here we can import the data set like uh, iris in my case so here is the database that I have imported so as you can see very easy it is to import the pandas library sorry the install the pandas library and import it either uh, you are in the command prompt uh, directly into the python or here in the Jupyter notebook which is a separate environment altogether using the pip command at both the scenarios in case of the command prompt you are directly using without exclamation sign but here in case of Jupyter notebook you are using the exclamation sign to install the pandas so that's very quickly about how you can install in both these uh, scenarios or both these environments and import it as well for doing your data analysis.